Good afternoon, everybody. I'd like to welcome you to the AAF Roanoke Awards Gala. Thank you all for getting here this afternoon and attending. Um, we will try to finish up the entire show as quickly as we can. I know it's late in the afternoon. Um, feel free to grab your gala boxes and get them out and have them with you um, as we go through the show today. If you have people who couldn't get into the Zoom today, we are also live streaming on our Facebook page. So um, let's get on and enjoy the show. My name is Carrie Cousins. I am the president of AAF Roanoke. And first and foremost, I would just like to thank everyone who submitted work this year. Um, we are thrilled at the number of entries we had and the work was fantastic. It goes without saying that the past year has been unlike anything we could have imagined. Last year's in-person gala was just days before our region and state began to shut down for what we thought was two weeks of working from home. What did we know? Almost a year later, all of us are working differently. New locations, new types of projects, and new challenges. Thank you all for rock starring it for your clients. Thank you for supporting your teams and colleagues. And thank you for continuing to be a part of AAF. We hope that you got your deliveries earlier this week and you're enjoying them. Please continue to hold on to your briefcase until we talk about it in the show. Here's a look at what we're gonna have happening during today's program. First, we're gonna go through the student awards, then the professional awards, then we will announce the student best of show, then the professional best in show, and then our special awards. We will have door prizes between awards. So if you have a gala box, you probably have a blue ticket in that box. That blue ticket is your ticket to prizes during this show. Remember again, if you have a briefcase, please wait and we will open the briefcases together at the end of the show. Now, before we get started, I'd like you to open up your gala box or grab a snack from your kitchens and grab a beverage so we can enjoy the show together. And to get you motivated, we've got a little help from Lucky Roanoke who's gonna show you how to make one of the beverages included in some of your gala boxes. Hey everybody, my name is Taylor Mann here at Lucky Restaurant in Rhode Island, Virginia. And today we're gonna to walk through how to make a Tommy's Margarita. So to begin, we'll use half ounce of blue agave syrup. One ounce of fresh squeezed lime juice. and two ounces of Reposado tequila. We'll add some ice and give it a nice shake. glass with ice. And then strain our cocktail. And there you have the classic Tommy's Margarita. Cheers. And now let's move on to the student awards. Actually, first let's have May give out a door prize while I figure out a little technical difficulty. 
Good afternoon, everyone. I've got my handy dandy bowl of tickets here. So if you would, now is a great time to pull out that blue ticket that's in your gala box. Um, and if you can't find it immediately, it's probably inside your blue cup. So here we go. Our first winner is, oh goodness. All right, who has 8261952? If you've got that ticket, um, please drop your email in the chat so we can be sure to email your gift card to you. So you are the winner, 826-1952. And you're welcome to unmute yourself and shout out, hey, it's me. No one yet? No one owning up yet. All right, we'll let them hang on and see if they send it to us after the show. Okay, I'll put the, um, the winning ticket number in the chat. Perfect, and I'm gonna go ahead and roll the student awards. All right, let's go. category of sales and marketing, sales promotion, packaging, a student gold addy goes to Brooke Gorman for Olive Garden, done for Radford University. In the category of sales and marketing collateral material, a student gold addy goes to Adam Harris for Silver Pig Barbecue Stationery Package, done for Liberty University. In the category of sales and marketing, collateral material, publication design, magazine design, a Student Silver Addy Award goes to Lauren Renee Slough for Slough Portfolio Art Book, done for Radford University. In the category of sales and marketing, collateral material, book design, a Student Silver Addy goes to Reagan Adams for a Taste of Astrology, done for Virginia Tech. In the sales and marketing category, collateral material, book design, a student silver Addy Award goes to Sydney Morris for a book about Lynchburg, done for Liberty University. In the category of print advertising, magazine advertising, campaign, a student gold Addy goes to Madison Richmond, and Virginia Caravas for Van's conceptual ad series done for Liberty University. Madison Richmond, illustrator, designer, and editor. Virginia Caravas, illustrator, designer, and editor. In the category of out of home, ambient media, poster. A student gold addy goes to Austin Marcus Green for Paula Shear Homage, done for Radford University. In the category of out of home ambient media, outdoor and transit advertising, mass transit, a student gold addy goes to Traffic Jams for Traffic Jams, done for Liberty University. Credits go to Madison Fogarty, designer, Sydney Raby, designer, Olivia Smith, designer, Heather Berkland, designer, Landon Broward, designer, and Kirsten Burgard, designer. 
in the category of online interactive websites, website, desktop, or mobile, a student goal daddy goes to Sarah Schaefer for the art of glass blowing done for Virginia Tech. In the category of online interactive social media, a student silver Addy award goes to Mackenzie Hessler for Your Vote Matters, done for Virginia Tech. In the category of cross-platform integrated advertising campaign, a student silver Addy goes to Madison Fogarty, Sydney Morris Raby, Olivia Smith, Landon Brower, Heather Berklin, and Kirsten Burgard for the one-stop spot done for Liberty University. In the category of cross-platform integrated brand identity campaign, a student gold Addy Award goes to Narissa Baroni for Cape Town Summer Olympics 2032, done for Virginia Tech. In the category of cross-platform integrated campaigns, a student gold Addy Award goes to Brooke Gorman for Kruger and Toll, done for Radford University. In the category of cross-platform integrated campaigns, integrated brand identity campaign, a student silver Addy Award goes to Lauren Renee Slough for Mutt Brewing Company, done for Radford University. In the category of cross-platform integrated campaigns, a student silver Addy Award goes to Virginia Tech PRISM 2020 recruitment campaign, done for Virginia Tech. Credits go to Charlotte Cannon Designer, Mackenzie Hessler Designer, Megan Monroe Designer, Rebecca Miller Designer, Allison Monahan Copywriter, Victoria Trompak Strategist, Lucille Reyes Strategist, Layla Hauser Strategist, Savannah Meredith Strategist, and Hannah Crone Strategist. In the category of cross-platform integrated campaigns, a student silver Addy goes to Ethan Candelario for Cabo Fish Taco brand identity, done for Virginia Tech. In the category of cross-platform campaigns, a student silver Addy goes to Julia Schneider for Katu Gelato Company, done for Liberty University. In the category of Elements of Advertising Logo Design, a Student Silver Addy Award goes to Kelly Wiegand for Reykjavik 2032 Olympics logo done for Virginia Tech. In the category of Elements of Advertising Logo Design, a Student Silver Addy Award goes to Abby Conrad for Bear Hugs Donuts done for Virginia Tech. In the category of Elements of Advertising, Illustration, a Student Silver Addy Award goes to Justin Creasy for Creativity in the Wild, done for Radford University. Let's take it over to May for another prize break. May, do you want to pull two tickets this time around? I sure do, Carrie. <laughs> Let's see if we can have someone actually hear and speak up and get our winner this time. Let's see. Okay, the first one is 826. One nine four two. Do we have a winner here? Winner here. All right. Yay. Congratulations. Wouldn't you know it? <laughs> okay. Well, I think we've got your contact information. You sure so do. I'm going to go ahead <laughs> and hold on to this ticket for you. Congratulations. So I'm gonna move right along to the second one. 
And this one, this gift card will go to 826-1977. Who's got that 1977? Any takers? Anyone want to speak up on that? Nope, not yet. Okay, I can put that one in the chat too. I'll go ahead and do that. I'll put that information in the chat. So whoever won that gift card, just send us your email, your contact information. Thank you. All right, thank you, May. And another round of congratulations to all the student winners. Now, let's take a look at all of our professional award winners. In the category of sales and marketing, sales promotion, packaging campaign, a Gold Addy Award goes to Virginia Tech for Eastern Divide Brewing Company labels, done for Eastern Divide Brewing Company. Credits go to Megan A. D., designer and illustrator, and Brandon Robertson, brewer and sign painter. In the category of sales and marketing, collateral material, special event material, card, invitation, announcement campaign, a Gold Addy Award goes to Anstey Hodge Advertising Group for Framatome Speakeasy event done for Framatome. Credits go to Karen Farrar, art director and designer, and Michelle Curley, account manager and copywriter. In the category of sales and marketing, collateral material, printed annual report, a Silver Addy Award goes to Art in Situ for Resilience. CHIP RV Annual Report done for Child Health Investment Partnership of Roanoke Valley. <laughs> Credits go to Min Young, Creative Director and Graphic Designer. Autumn Lavering, COO, CHIP of Roanoke Valley. Robin Haldeman, CEO, CHIP of Roanoke Valley. And Bill Gilmer, Word Sprint. In the category of sales and marketing, collateral material, special events material, card, invitation, announcement, a Silver Addy Award goes to Anstey Hodge Advertising Group for Hawthorne Groundbreaking Event done for Presbyterian Village North. Credits go to David Hodge, Creative Director, Erica Cundiff, Art Director and Copywriter, and Donna Wardell, account manager. In the category of sales and marketing, collateral material, book design, a Gold Addy Award goes to Radford University for Radford University Brand Guide, done for Radford University. Oh. Credits go to Robin Dowdy, designer, <laughs> and contributors, <laughs> Caitlin Skaggs, Pam McAllister, Ryder Deal, Jeff Greenough, James Harmon. In the category of sales and marketing, direct marketing, direct mail, a Gold Addy Award goes to Anstey Hodge Advertising Group for Framatome Speakeasy Box Invitation done for Framatome. Credits go to Karen Farrar, Art Director and Designer, and Michelle Curley, Account Manager and Copywriter. In the category of out of home and ambient media, out of home, site, interior or exterior, a Silver Addy Award goes to Anstey Hodge Advertising Group for Hang 10 exterior sign done for Hang 10 Hawaiian Ice and Cream. Credits go to Erica Cundiff, Art Director and Illustrator, and John Anstey, Account Manager. In the category of online interactive websites, B2B, a Gold Addy Award goes to Five Points Creative for Gregory Pallet website done for Gregory Pallet and Lumber. 
<laughs> Credits go to Aaron Kelderhouse, creative director, design did it. and site build, Molly Doyle, videography and photography, Zion Stores, site build, and Brad Booth, digital director. In the category of online interactive websites consumer, a Silver Addy Award goes to Anstey Hodge Advertising Group for Hang Ten website, done for Hang Ten Hawaiian Ice and Cream. Credits go to Erica Cundiff, Art Director and Copywriter, Patrick Carroll, Interactive Art Director, John Anstey, Account Manager and Copywriter, and Erica Cundiff, Illustrator. In the category of Online Interactive Social Media Campaign, a Gold Addy Award goes to Virginia Tech Dining Services for Behind the Mask, done for Virginia Tech Dining Services. Credits go to Haley Conrad, Social Media Coordinator and Digital Graphic Designer. Darren Van Dyke, Photographer and Videographer. Will Rizzo, Writer and Editor. And Victoria Boatwright, Marketing and Communications Manager. In the category of Online Interactive Blogs and Digital Publications, a Silver Addy Award goes to Carillion Clinic for the 2019 Report to the Community done for Carillion Clinic. Credits go to Carillion Marcom team for editing, creative direction, and photography, and Monogle for writing, designing, and production. In the category Film, Video, and Sound, Online Film, Video, and Sound Internet Commercial, a Silver Addy Award goes to Cry for Mass Mutual Health Bridge, done for Mass Mutual. Credits go to Justin Rossbacher, Director, Cody Wilson, Producer, Juan Novales, Editor, Johans Leonardo, Creative Team. In the category Film, Video, and Sound, Online Film, Video, and Sound, Internet Commercial, a Silver Eddy Award goes to Red Velocity Incorporated for Heartball 2020, done for American Heart Association. Credits go to Steve Mason, Producer, Director, Jacob Dellinger, Creative Director and Director of Photography, and Tracy Hopridge, Assistant Producer. I had no idea when and if this aneurysm would burst. I was afraid. You look at the doctor and you're like, what's going on? And he says, you're having a heart attack. My husband had multiple heart attacks. I felt like I was a ticking time bomb. And I was terrified. You know, is this it? We were living moment by moment. Without this surgery, the outcome was death and you're praying please lord don't let me go the third stroke scared me the most i thought for sure i was gonna die my vascular surgeon called me into his office please pray for me i don't know what i'd do without my family i had so much i wanted to do a big bucket list <laughs> all these thoughts are running through your mind what will my family do what will my wife do you know i just all those thoughts of what what ifs all those what ifs if the heart technology and care that we have today was available 15 years ago, my husband might still be with us. In the category Film, Video, and Sound, Online Film, Video, and Sound Internet Commercial Campaign, a Silver Addy goes to cry for 2020 Jack How-Tos done for Virginia Energy Sense. 
Credits go to Justin Rossbacker, Director, John Carl, DP and Colorist, Mary Carl, Production Support, Felicia Pan, Production Support and Talent, David Salchak, VFX, and Juan Novalis, Post-Production Support. Hey, homeowner, Jack here. If you're always on the go, unlike me, it's easy to forget to change that filter in the heat pump. A good rule of thumb is every three months. You can get rid of the dust bunnies and pet dander, which will help you cut back on your energy. Heck, it might help your allergies, too. In the category Film, Video, and Sound, Online Film, Video, and Sound Webisode, a Silver Addy Award goes to Virginia Tech Dining Services for breadcrumbs done for Virginia Tech Dining Services. Credits go to Darren Van Dyke, photographer and videographer, and Victoria Boatwright, marketing and communications manager. My name is Mark Moritz. I am the executive chef senior at Turner Place here at Virginia Tech. I have been working at Virginia Tech for almost nine years now. Bruno is our sourdough starter that uh, has been around for almost 15 years now. He'll be 15 in August. Uh, he started from wild grapes that grew across the street from where I lived in South Carolina. Every day our bakers come in here at Turner Place between 4.30 and quarter to five. Uh, to get the doughs ready for the day, to get them into the proof box, and to uh, get them baked off for the morning production. In order to start his day, we have to feed him every day 40 pounds of flour, as well as 40 pounds of water. Temperature is everything. Generally speaking, we like our doughs right around 72 degrees during the summer and fall, and about 82 degrees during the winter time. And every day we go through a format where we test the, the ambient air in the category Film, Video, and Sound, Branded Content and Entertainment for Online Film, Video, and Sound, a Silver Addy Award goes to Carillion Clinic for Carillion Hospice Jack Dudley, done for Carillion Clinic. Credits go to Joe Cascliani, Director, Producer, Daryl Arnold, Videographer, and Aaron Cooper, Marketing Consultant. Oh my, <laughs> where do you want me to start about Jack? Yeah, there seems like there's probably a whole lot of things I could rattle off about him. Jack Dudley was a very special man to me. He is one of those people that really, I don't think I could ever forget. Right off the bat, we just had an immediate connection. He had a big personality, lots and lots of friends. Everybody knew Jack Dudley. <laughs> really one of the biggest things about Jack was just his heart. He was one of those people that really, truly loved people. He was always looking for something he could do to help somebody. Jack was an interesting character, okay? Um, delightful husband, uh, great father, great grandfather. He was the director of honors at Virginia Tech. This is Jack as he was first starting the honors program had lots of students that came back to see him over the years, so you know he was a great mentor. In the category Film, Video, and Sound, Advertising Industry Self-Promotion for Film, Video, and Sound, a silver eddy goes to Five Points Creative for That's Our Normal, done for Five Points Creative. Credits go to Bruce C. Bryan, Concept and Creative Direction, Molly Doyle, Director and Editor, and Aaron Kelderhaus, Creative Direction and Script. What is normal? Where do you find it? What does it look like? Normal is where it's always been. You find it in the simple things, the sunsets and sunrises, small acts of kindness, encouraging words, in our work and how we play. We've always valued the small, simple moments in Virginia's Blue Ridge. It's who we are, no matter what else changes. That's our normal. In the category cross-platform integrated campaigns, integrated advertising campaign, consumer, a gold eddy goes to Carillion Clinic for ortho like no other, 
done for Carillion Clinic. Credits go to Corey Thrasher, art director, Amy Lauracella, copywriter, Andrea Draper, marketing consultant, Jared Ladia, photographer, and John Griesmeyer, creative director. In the category of cross-platform integrated campaigns, integrated advertising campaigns, consumer, local, a Silver Addy Award goes to Carillion Clinic for mask campaign done for Carillion Clinic. Credits go to Nicholas Buring, art director, Laura Mitchell, copywriter, Anna Campbell, social media specialist, and John Griesmeyer, creative director. In the category of cross-platform, integrated campaigns, integrated brand identity campaign, local or regional, national, a Silver Eddy Award goes to Jabba Studio for AIPO done for Athlete Initial Private Offering. Credits go to Kevin Jones, creative director, Robin Jones, project manager, and Patrick Finley, designer. In the category cross-platform, advertising industry self-promotion cross-platform, ad club or marketing club, a gold addy goes to AAF Roanoke for flux capacitor award carrier done for AAF Roanoke. Credits go to Peggy Underwood, graphic and structural designer, Ray Dwyer, structural design manager, and Pratt Roanoke digital printer and manufacturer. In the category of cross-platform, advertising industry self-promotion cross-platform, ad club or marketing club, a Silver Eddy Award goes to AAF Roanoke for Back to the Future of Advertising, done for AAF Roanoke. Credits go to Peggy Underwood, graphic design manager, Ray Dwyer, structural design manager, and Pratt Roanoke, digital printer and manufacturer. In the category of cross-platform, advertising industry self-promotion cross-platform, advertising industry self-promotion campaigns, single medium campaign, a silver Addy award goes to Pratt Industries Roanoke for We Are In This Together, done for Pratt Roanoke Converting. Credits go to Peggy Underwood, graphic design manager, Ray Dwyer, Structural Design Manager, and Pratt Roanoke, Digital Printer and Manufacturer. In the category of Elements of Advertising, Visual, Logo Design, a Silver Addy Award goes to Virginia Tech Dining Services for Blend Logo, done for Virginia Tech Dining Services. Credits go to Joy Blackburn, Graphic Designer, and Victoria Boatwright, Marketing and Communications Manager. In the category of Elements of Advertising, Visual, Illustration, Series, a Gold Addy Award goes to Virginia Tech for Eastern Divide Illustrations done for Eastern Divide Brewing Company. Credits go to Megan A. D., Designer and Illustrator, and Brandon Robertson, Brewer and Sign Painter. In the category of elements of advertising, visual, still photography, black and white, color, or digitally enhanced campaign, a gold addy goes to Virginia Tech Dining Services for curate meal done for Virginia Tech Dining Services. Credits go to Darren Van Dyke, photographer, videographer, and Victoria Boatwright, marketing and communications manager. In the category of elements of advertising, film and video, animation, special effects, or motion graphics, CGI, animation, special effects, or motion graphics, a gold addy goes to Virginia Tech Dining Services for Chili Challenge Animation done for Virginia Tech Dining Services. Credits go to Darren Van Dyke, photographer, videographer, 
Joy Blackburn, graphic designer, and Victoria Boatwright, marketing and communications manager. In the category of elements of advertising, film and video, animation, special effects or motion graphics, computer generated imagery or CGI, a Gold Addy Award goes to M3 Graphics for Boss, logo open, done for Boss Motion Picture Company. Credits go to Jamal Milner for modeling, lighting, surfacing, animation, and compositing, and Jamie Neighbors for editing. In the category of elements of advertising, digital creative technology, innovative use of interactive technology, a silver addy goes to uncork it incorporated for as you so interactive gather space done for as you so credits go to eileen bauman president of uncork it welcome to gather this avatar is you you use your avatar to explore and interact with the virtual world within gather to navigate the virtual space you use your keyboard to move your avatar, use your arrow keys. As your avatar gets close to another person's avatar, their video box will pop up and you'll be able to see them, hear them, and talk to them. Hello. If you move away from someone, their video and audio will fade out. Just like any other gathering, you can mingle with and move between different groups. You can increase the size of other attendees' video chat boxes by clicking on this arrow beneath them. To collapse this view, click on the arrow. In the category of public service, out of home and ambient media, Corporate Social Responsibility Out of Home. A Silver Eddy Award goes to Anstey Hodge Advertising Group for socially distanced logo banner done for Anstey Hodge Advertising Group. Credits go to David Hodge, Creative Director, Matt Brown, Art Director, and John Anstey, Creative Director. In the category of political advertising, political out of home and ambient media, a gold addy goes to Virginia Tech for to not speak is to speak, done for AIGA get out the vote. Credits go to Megan A.D., designer and illustrator. In the category Local Only, a Gold Addy Award goes to Roanoke Regional Partnership Get to Know Noak for the Playbook Event Program done for Roanoke Regional Partnership Get to Know Noak. Credits go to Kerry Cousins, Director of Communications. to make the Cuban classic, the mojito. Uh, so to begin with, we'll take about five or six leaves of uh, some fresh mint, uh, particularly spearmint if you have it available to yourself. Uh, next, we will add our sugar. Uh, this is a simple syrup 
uh, that we've made in house and we will do one ounce of that. One ounce of fresh squeezed lime juice. And then we'll use our muddler just to mash that together. Uh, you don't want to pulverize it uh, because of the mint tears and then it gets kind of stuck in your teeth as you enjoy the cocktail. Uh, and also if you over muddle it, uh, you're going to get a lot more of that bitter flavor from the mint as opposed to that brightness that you're looking for. And then we'll fill the glass with ice. Add our sparkling water. And lastly, we'll add our two ounces of clear rum. Gently stir the ingredients together. And there you have your classic mojito. Cheers. And let's kick it back over to May for yet another prize drawing. May? All right. This one is going to be a $50 um, gift card to DoorDash. So we're up in the stakes a little bit. <laughs> and the winner of this one is um, 826-1945. So who is that lucky number 45 at the end of that little blue ticket? Do we have one? Let's see. I see some people dancing. Can't tell if they're the winners or not, but they sure are <laughs> having fun. BT is over there. They're pretending. Yeah, that looks like he's got it. Oh, yes. It. <laughs> I see it now. Congratulations. And that looks like Jeff Joyner. So um, I've got you down there. And congratulations. Thank you, May, for awarding those prizes and congrats to those prize winners. We'll have one more drawing here at the end of the show. Now, this is what you've been waiting for. The best in show for both the student and professional awards. A student judge's choice goes to Adam Harris for Silver Pig Barbecue Stationery Package done for Liberty University. A student judge's choice award goes to Lauren Renee Slough for Slough Portfolio Art Book done for Radford University. A student judge's choice goes to Kelly Wiegan for Reykjavik 2032 Olympics logo done for Virginia Tech. The student best of show goes to Austin Marcus Green for Paula Shear Homage, done for Radford University. The best of electronic goes to Virginia Tech Dining Services for Chili Challenge Animation done for Virginia Tech Dining Services. Credits go to Darren Van Dyke, photographer, videographer, Joy Blackburn, graphic designer, and Victoria Boatwright, marketing and communications manager. The best of digital goes to Five Points Creative for Gregory Pallet website, done for Gregory Pallet and Lumber. Credits go to Aaron Kelderhouse, Creative Direction, Design, 
and site build. Molly Doyle, Videography and Photography, Zion Stores, Site Build, and Brad Booth, Digital Director. The best of print goes to Virginia Tech for Eastern Divide Brewing Company labels done for Eastern Divide Brewing Company. Credits go to Megan A. D., designer and illustrator, and Brandon Robertson, brewer and sign painter. The Howard Packett Award for Creative Excellence with Best of Show goes to Virginia Tech for To Not Speak Is To Speak, done for AIGA Get Out The Vote. Credits go to Megan A. D., designer and illustrator. Everybody at AAF, I would like to congratulate the winners. You all did some amazing work this year. And I'm going to let May grab one more door prize. And then we're all going to grab our cases. So while you're listening for May to call the numbers, you might want to grab your case and have it handy. Just note, if you have a heavy one, particularly if it's black, you probably don't want to pick it up by the handle. All right, May, take it away. All right, our last door prize of this afternoon and our um, $100 gift card winner is 8261951. That is 1951. Let's see who's won that prize. Anyone? I'm going to check out the chat to see if anyone has put their information there. And may I also say, if you were watching this on Facebook Live or you're in a place where you can't claim it right here, feel free to email me directly at info at aafroanoke.org with a picture of your winning ticket, and I will make sure you get your prize. Okay. Um... Ah, Norm Miller at VCOM says he's the winner. Awesome. <laughs> May, did you get through all the drawings or do you have anything left over? Well, I think we've got um, one more $25. Let's do it. Prize. I say yes, let's, let's go for that. All righty, let me just pretend there's a drum roll. Okay, that last one is going to be. Okay, 1944. Who's got that? 8261944. And that will be a $25 gift card. that anyone here I'm going to go ahead and put that in the chat as Carrie said in case someone's watching on Facebook thank you May for getting all those prizes I hope everyone at home or in your office or wherever you were got to dig into those cases um, I know the anticipation over the last 24 to 48 hours has been 
a little insane and I hope you didn't peek. Um, now I am going to turn it over to Ananda Gilmore to hand out our special awards this afternoon. Yep. Um, hello, everyone. I am Ananda Gilmore. I am the special awards chair for AAF Roanoke. The special awards are comprised of Advertising Person of the Year, Vendor of the Year, and new this year, the Public Service Only Award, the Roanoke Shine Award. These three awards are not lifetime achievement awards. These are intended to recognize the past year's outstanding accomplishments of individuals in the advertising and marketing industries. Nominees can be from the fields of media, design, advertising, marketing, broadcast, or interactive, and membership in the advertising club is not required in order to be nominated. Nominations are submitted by peers and awardees are voted on by a committee of previous winners. Votes are cast solely on the quality and caliber of a single nomination and a winner for each category isn't always selected every year. At this time, I would like to give a shout out to all our previous special award winners, if we have any with us today. And now for this year's winners. This year, the committee awarded two out of the three awards categories, the Roanoke Shine Award and Advertising Person of the Year. First up is the Roanoke Shine Award. This was a new award created this year to give special consideration specifically to those who have gone above and beyond in the past year for their public service efforts. Many of you in the advertising industry have likely heard of Buzz for Good. But for those of you who haven't, Buzz for Good has created a series of TV shows highlighting nonprofits in our area and the needs these organizations have fulfilling their missions of serving the underserved populations. The shows partner each nonprofit with professional creatives to help market the nonprofit in the hopes of increasing support and magnifying the work of the organization in our local community. Some of the organizations who have been helped through Buzz for Good include the Southwest Virginia Ballet, the Mill Mountain Zoo, Ram House, and the Mountain Valley Charitable Foundation. These organizations have received tens of thousands of dollars in support for promoting their brands and supporting their marketing efforts. And that results in the ability for each nonprofit to concentrate further on fundraising and to devote their time to their missions. I'm proud to announce this year's winner of the Roanoke Shine Award is Michael Humphill of Buzz for Good. <laughs> Next award up is Advertising Person of the Year. First off, I'd like to say how impressed the voting committee was of our Ad Person of the Year nominations. We had tough competition this year and we received many well-written, very specific nominations. It was a very difficult decision and that's a good thing. I think most of us can understand the challenges our teachers and higher education instructors have had over the past year. With online learning becoming the norm, professors have had to get really creative in order to engage and encourage student learning at all levels. This year's Ad Person of the Year did just that and more. This year's winner led the student-run, faculty-led graphic design agency for design at Virginia Tech in spite of the pandemic and went above and beyond to make sure his coworkers and students felt supported. The nominee was said to always be ready with dad jokes, but also for outreach activities with high school students interested in advertising and design, online game nights, and virtual Bob Ross style paint alongs, all while taking over as program co-chair of the graphic design program. Additionally, this nominee was recognized on an international scale by being invited by Ken Friedman, editor of SheG the Journal of Design, Economics, and Innovation to submit an article on his experiences with 4Design and how student-run design studios can help students learn what design classes don't teach. The nominee was also invited to present empathy and user experience in advertising and design at the Idea of School of Advertising in Tehran, Iran. 
The nominee pivoted a 20 plus year advertising career into teaching marketing design and advertising in higher ed. But this change paid off with the nominee often credited for guiding many of his students into careers of advertising. Just some of the feedback we saw in the nomination was, this nominee's demeanor was helpful in creating an active learning environment. On top of teaching us technical skills, he also helped foster a sense of confidence in ourselves. He gives constructive, knowledgeable feedback while also remembering to celebrate achievements, especially when we as the students might not see them for ourselves. During a year where many students lost the college experience they dreamed of, this nominee clearly helped build a sense of community, was always there for his students and would do his best to make them laugh or at least roll their eyes over a truly terrible dad joke. I'm proud to announce this year's Advertising Person of the Year as Jeff Joyner. Thanks everybody. And congratulations to our winners. Thank you, Ananda. And congratulations, Jeff and Michael, you are in very elite company. Um, and I'd like to remind you all, um, please take pictures of your awards, take pictures of your parties and your teams and share them with us on social media. We, while we can't be there together today, we want to make sure that we are sharing in this collective experience. So thank you so much for being here. And I kind of have a list thank of thank you yous before we go. And um, there are some people who have really put major effort into this production today. So I'd really like to thank the team that put this show together, um, starting with Mae Johnson. Um, she's done a phenomenal job as awards chair, partnered with Stephen Sanford. They have rock starred this thing out this year, and I appreciate that. Also on this team was Peggy Underwood, Leanne Kelly, Michael Craighead, Bill Houck, Ananda Gilmore, Angie Marks, Jamal Milner, Michael Hemphill, and Cindy Rollins. They did everything from plan the event, to deliver your packages, to helping arrange judging and setting up this virtual program. The rest of the AAF board has really been working hard behind the scenes all year as well to provide information and programming, and that won't stop after today's show. Be on the lookout in your email for future programs in the spring. I'd like to thank our sponsors as well. Um, they really helped make this event possible. That includes Lucky Roanoke, Mass General Store, Chocolate Paper, Paper, and Anstey Hodge Advertising Group. Super special thanks go to Bison Printing for printing our winner's books, which are in your briefcases. To Peggy Underwood and Pratt Roanoke for the amazing party boxes and award carriers. I can't Woo! tell you how special this has been watching these come together and watching Peggy's brain work. Um, it's absolutely amazing. And if there's any way you can contact Peggy and need something for this, please reach out. It's stellar, as you can see. And finally, I'd like to give a big shout out to Lamar Advertising. One of the bonuses that all of you award winners are getting this year is not only in your package, did you see a little billboard? But this billboard is gonna be running live across the region for the next two weeks. Every single winner will have a billboard in rotation. Um, thank you, Lamar, for providing that to these winners. And you may have noticed there's kind of a transition happening here. Some things have the traditional AAF Roanoke logo on them, while some have the new. This is the official start to the rollout of the new brand for AAF Roanoke. And finally, all gold winners will automatically forward to the district for judging and you don't have to do anything. All silver medal winners can be forwarded as well and we will send you information about that in your email. We will also email you about 
purchasing duplicate awards for yourself or your clients if you want them. Just be on your lookout for an email with details on that. And on behalf of AAF Roanoke, thank you. Thank you for entering. Thank you for being here. And thank you for sharing your talent with our region. It's really important and super special. I'm actually gonna stop screen share now really quick. And I encourage everyone to turn on your camera and show off your awards or just celebrate everybody else who's here and just take a minute and feel free to just have a minute to be excited because that's what this is all about. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations, everybody. Congratulations. Have a wonderful Thursday. Yeah. Good job, Carrie. Congratulations. Thank you, Carrie. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, thanks. Good job, Gary. Thank you, Gary. Thank you. Thank you, Mike. We have a big winner. Hey, Lauren. Congrats, thank Mike. <laughs> Too, Aaron. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, man. Congratulations, everybody. We'd like to thank our judges who made this all possible for selecting our winners. Yes. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Good job, Darren.